Hi everyone, this is Ritvik Sham, a first year undergraduate student studying electrical and electronics engineering here at Imperial College London. I am an Indian national, I come from India, uh, I've lived in India for 12 years in various cities, after which I moved to Jakarta in Indonesia and I lived here for six years uh, before moving to London. How I felt moving out of home and you know settling into university. Undoubtedly, it was a very tough period. Uh, there were many thoughts that kept bothering me and I was always worried whether I would settle down well um, into this new life because until then I had never been uh, west of Asia in my life. So it, it was a whole new thing for me. Uh, the good news is from day one, you're surrounded with people, you're surrounded with friends across the board, whether it's your hall friends or your course mates, and they're all on the same boat. Most of them are you know, living independently for the first time. So they share the same feelings as you. So it's, um, we're all in the same boat and the multiple opportunities provided both by the halls as well as the college, as well as the university uh, to basically uh, encourage uh, social interactions. The reason I chose Imperial College London as my destination to study well, there are so many factors involved. Firstly, it's the academic reputation, the quality of teaching, the, the academic environment in general, which is so stimulating, which is so great, especially for my course in engineering. And more importantly, the employability uh, of Imperial graduates. It's among the best in the UK. The application process was quite straightforward and the academic requirements and standards were made very clear from the very beginning, it was always clearly mentioned in the Imperial website, in the department website. And within a few months of submitting my UCAS application, I received an interview offer and the interview also went off thankfully pretty well. And most questions were based on the personal statements. You, you won't be asked something which is quite uh, so tricky. Uh, rather, it is all based on the personal statement, which is another great factor, which makes the application so much easier and more convenient. The course content itself is also quite interesting and stimulating because you also get to see the hands-on things. Uh, there is a heavy practical element involved and uh, Imperial invests so much in these uh, practicals and it, it's really nice to learn as you go and apply your learning as and when you learn it. Personally, I'm part of many societies, uh, not as much as some of my friends, but certainly uh, from a range. So I'm part of the gaming and robotics society as well, alongside being member of the Indian and the Hindu society. So uh, quite a balance there between uh, sort of academics, chilling out, as well as staying rooted to my culture and traditions. And if you are into partying, then London is one of the best places. Alongside academic support from assistants, professors, you also have a personal tutor. I meet my personal tutor once every fortnight and the personal tutor generally goes through not just your academic routine, but also your social life. He inquires, he or she inquires about your well-being. And uh, there's also the well-being um, advisor and each department has a well-being advisor. The other thing is that the student hub uh, is so helpful and especially for international students uh, they answer all the queries and they're a very approachable community my biggest advice to prospective students is be calm be have an open mind uh, be confident and imperial is the right place for you it will bring out the best within you both academically and will also push you out of your comfort zone uh, give you the right skills needed for a good uh, career later on in future and obviously the memories uh, of being in London are going to stick on forever. And that's it from me. Uh, goodbye. Hope you're all safe. And thanks for watching.